So let's see what Mr. Homer here, our homie pigeon, might have for a snack today. It looks like he has some seed. So I'll put it in a seed dish and show him where it is. And hopefully he will find it right here. There he goes. He's pecking away at seed. Pigeons eat grains and seed and some berries. Can and you they hear use him? A beak, right? They yes. don't have a mouth like ours. No, birds don't have a mouth. What do we call their mouth? We call it a beak. Okay. I'm going to kind of hold Mr. Uh, Homer here so you can get a close up of his face. He has two eyes. He has two ears, but you don't see them. They're under his feathers. He has two legs. And instead of two arms, he has two wings. Let's see if he'll let us touch his wing a little bit. All right, I'm going to gently hold him, and we're going to open up a wing. Can you see his beautiful wing? Okay, and underneath it, his feathers. And why we're looking at those kind of feathers, what we call his flight feathers, here's a feather that is a down feather. We call that a down feather, and it's stuck to Miss Robin. But let's see if we can see some other down feathers. Here's underneath, Miss Anne. Can you see those soft feathers around his leg? I can. All right, that keeps him warm in the cold and rainy weather. He also has a little ring on his mm -hmm. ankle. He does, and his birth date, his birthday is in there, and it also has the name of where uh, he came from, what city, uh, it has uh, the type of pigeon he is. He is a homing pigeon. That's how he got his name, we just call him Homer. And while we're watching him eat, I also want to let you know that when pigeon babies are born, they're hatched from eggs. They don't have mama's milk to drink like baby mammals do. Mom and dad bird need to find food for their babies, and then they chew that food up really good, and it's a lot like baby food in a jar, and they cough it back up, regurgitate it, and feed it to the baby bird. Uh, baby birds have to stay in their nest for quite a while until they grow their own feathers. And then they stand around and exercise on the nests or on the branches where the nest is until they're strong enough to fly. These birds are called fledglings. Shall we go fly?